Barbies! Welcome back. I'm Melanie Raylin, y'all, and thanks for tuning in. Please do not mind how look I'm getting ready for work, y'all, but hmm, let's get into it. I just got out the shower. I put on my moisturizer. So I'm gonna just get into doing my makeup. Really. Um, it's all in my bag that I bring to work. Let me go grab it. Like, I totally recommend, like, to bring a bag of deodorant, lotion, lip gloss, and, like, some stuff to touch your makeup up with because that's what I do. Just really, like, necessities, basically. Like, makeup necessities. Just so you can really freshen up because it be hot enough and then it get cold, then it's high, your hair might frizz up, anything. Anything can really happen. So the first step, y'all, I just put on this power grip. Who was it by Elf? And once it sit, once it dry, that's when I'll start putting on my concealer. Today I wanted to go for a different lip, but at the same time, I don't want to change it up. I don't know. I'll think about it. But y'all, do y'all see what I see? Let me know if you this. We ain't gonna talk about it. We ain't gonna talk about it. We ain't gonna talk about it, y'all. Because um, even though I hit it, I think, I believe I hit it... On the 25th or the 26th of August, I still haven't celebrated or even talked about it within my vlog because I really, like, if I show y'all, I have everything. I wanted to go out. I have everything that came in, but it kind of pushed me back because the place I ordered it from, I wanted to do it Sunday. Sunday, which was the 3rd. I wanted to do it September 3rd, but the package didn't come until Tuesday, I think on the 6th. So that really had me discouraged, but it's okay because I learned that it's never too late to celebrate you and your accomplishments. So I will still do it when I have time, y'all. But I've been dealing with school and work, my new job. So it's going to be a very like, I just want to make time. I need to make time to focus on me, period. But yeah, okay, since it's dry now, what I do is I go in with this. And this is number 17. I think it's like by Juvia, 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 something like that. Juvia place. But I just put it on under there. I really like it to be bright. Just so it can look like I have on makeup. Because I really don't wear it. But I'll put it right here on my chin and right here on my nose, forehead. And on my eyes, I'm going to put a little more, so I'm going to push that to the side. But while I'm doing that, I also have this in the shade 50 Cafe by Fit Me, the concealer as well. And I put it like on the sides of where I put my concealer at, my lighter concealer, only for the fact I don't want it to be like too noticeable. And I also use it to contour my nose, so that's what I'm going to do as well. All right, y'all, I'm back. So, let that sit for a little, especially your concealer, because you need to let it, like, soak in, soak in, soak in. actually wasn't gonna do this video because like I said I just started but I was talking to like the girls who I work with and it was like girl do it people wants to see it and I asked my spam y'all stop right here I public my spam I made my spam public so y'all can like get to know me a little better so if y'all want to follow me on my spam it's Raylan POV I, I don't think it has an underscore but that's what it's called if y'all want to join it's public and I do follow the girlies back with the spams.
my Hooters Girl makeup. This is the makeup I do almost every day. My, maybe not as like vibrant with the highlight, but as far as the concealer where I put it at and the blush, I do that literally every day. You don't have to have a full face of makeup. You can if you want, but they just require you to have something as far as mascara, oh, eyeliner, blush, highlight. You have to just have something on your face. So just to clear all that. So right now I'm about to do my hair and then I'll be back in here to put on my clothes. <laughs> All right, y'all. So now I'm in the bathroom, y'all. I'm finna do my hair. Ooh. I'm really a braised girly, but... Y'all, Dove really followed me all over this freaking apartment. Like, you don't give me no space, bro. Come see me. Come on. Say hi. Say hi first. Say hi. They love you. They love seeing you. <laughs> gonna add this one in its own vlog or I might just do like the whole weekend because today's Saturday I work tomorrow I worked yesterday but I was really like all over the place yesterday so didn't vlog yesterday but I'm done for right now with the hair I might do it before I leave again but it's getting hot in here but it is 3 15 I have to leave the house at 3 30 so I can put on my clothes. <laughs> The shorts feel tighter, but the top feel loose. But we're all black, but it, like you changed everything out. My book, my pins. Girl, they be trying to steal my pins. But I just be bringing like. At first, girl, I had my whole bag filled with pins, but that didn't work out too good. And I got change. You're gonna need change. I also have so what I have is pens and then I have like a mini perfume. Got her name tag, y'all. It's official. It's official. Goes on this side right here. I keep doing it backwards. Boom. So that's it. I'm about to put on my shoes, then I'm about to head out. y'all i'm finished getting dressed so i'm about to head over to work when i get to work i'll show y'all some things some girls and just like the environment y'all but this is the final fit my first time wearing the black to the girl outfit i love it 
and just comment down below how y'all think I look in a uniform and if y'all have any more questions about the job. <laughs> Okay, y'all, so I made it. It's a jump start, so we're just. Hey, Barb. So I'm just getting off, y'all. And what's, where's my phone? So I could show y'all the time. I don't know if y'all can see, but it's 12.04, y'all, and I have to be back at 10. My feet are barking. Y'all, I had 42 people sit. Like, that's how many people I had today. And I had, everybody tipped me, so that's really good, but it got packed really quick on me. Like, I had two tables. Well, my first, I was supposed to have two tables, but I wound up having way more than two tables after, I think, 8.30. They gave me more tables. And, oh my God, it was just so much, so much, so much. They sent me with seven boys and then 30 minutes. I mean, I'm sorry. They sent me with seven bars and then 10 minutes later, they sent me with eight more boys. So, whatever, how much that is, that's 15 people just right there. And then right at 11 o'clock, five people came sat at my table. I'm like, oh my God, duh. I'm like, oh my God. And I didn't even get to them until like four minutes after they sat down because I was still dealing with the other people. Because keep in mind, it's seven different checks. You got to split it all up, all that, all that. But girl, my feet is hurting. I'll be back in the morning, y'all. Say hey, babe. Hey. You barbed. Hi. Hi, Poppy. Come here. Hi, my boy. Hi. You miss mommy? You miss me? Oh, that's so cute. But y'all, I'll holler at y'all once I get inside. Right now, I'm about to enjoy my foot massage and take a nap. <laughs> y'all, I'm so tired. It is now 12:28. We had to stop and get gas, y'all. But that's a wrap for today. Um. My tips. I did really good today, y'all. I'm not going to even lie. Did really good today. And I have work tomorrow, so I might record that. But if I don't, I just want to say thank y'all for watching. Give this video a big thumbs up. If y'all want to see more videos like this, comment down below. Comment down what I should add or what y'all want to see next time that I didn't add in this video. And subscribe if you haven't and become a part of the Barbie game because y'all know the Barbies are the best. Period. I will try to get some more footage if I record tomorrow. But that's it for tonight. Bye. Love you. Good morning, Barb. This is day two. Come to work with me as a Hooters girl, y'all. And today is Sunday. It's the Saints game. And, girl, it is 8.49. I have to be there for 10. As y'all see in the last clip, I got off at 12 o'clock p.m. I mean, I'm sorry. I got off at 12 o'clock a.m. And, y'all, I'm tired. I'm tired. But y'all know what I do. <clears throat> I have on my power grip gonna go in with this concealer y'all i am so tired but i get off at four today but i don't have bank so they might cut me which is fine like bank okay you have to bring twenty dollars to work just so you can break your um like if someone wants change you, you can give them change stuff like that but i don't have the 10 today because you're supposed to have one ten one five and five ones i'm not about to play with him I want to wear my short sleeve, y'all. They gave me a short sleeve today, but I will have to cover up my tats. I already tried to cover up this one, but it's not working. It looks a little covered, but you can still see it. I don't have time for that. Y'all, I ain't gonna lie. 
I'm trying to boost myself up, but I am really, really tired. So I'm going to play some music. Usually, I'm about to listen to some gospel music. No cap. Because that's what I usually listen to in, in the day. Well, I'm not going to lie. I've been slacking. But, like, last year, when I wake up, that's what I did. So I'm about to, you know, listen to some music. Um, this is my favorite one, y'all. I'm about to fast forward, y'all. y'all barbs i know y'all probably like what happened what happened what happened but it was game day saints i think the saints won y'all so let's give a round of applause to them um the customers was very happy about that but i think the score was like 15 16 if i'm not mistaken i'll probably put it right here for y'all to see but um so it was really busy busier than i thought it was going to be but i worked the morning shift so i i was there at 10 and i got off at four but it didn't get really busy until like 3.15-ish when the game ended. People started coming in around like 3.30. So I didn't really get the rush. It was pretty slow. I probably got like five tables. But um, I did good to say that they only started me off with two sec like two tables in my section. So that was really good, y'all. But I just want to tell y'all some things about Hooters. If y'all want to know. So um, so I've been applied for Hooters, y'all. I'm not going to even lie. I always wanted to work at Hooters, but, um, either I was just too young or I really didn't think I had time. But once I finally got an interview, they hired me on the spot and that was really good for me. And I just was happy about that. But I did have to take three tests. One of them is a C in, t one of the, the first test is the C in chart so you know all the tables in the sections um the second one was the menu test you need to know the most popular foods and like things that customers are going to ask you do you know what's in this do you know what's in that stuff like that the third test the third test was the drink um drink test that's just like if someone asks you you know what comes in bloody mary or the lemon drop you know stuff like that um the lit the tropical lit People ask that all the time, y'all, and people get beer a lot. So you, you, the beer is not on a test, but you need to know like the beer still because a lot of men come in there, even women come in there want to drink beers. This they want to know this that here, this that you know, whatever. Um, and you get four training days. The first day you will take your first test. Second day you will take your second test. Third day you will take your third test, and then on the fourth day you will do any makeups if you fail the test. And that's going to be your last training day. Um, we do have two different uniforms. We have the black and the white uniforms. Black uniforms are one on game day, I think. Yeah, black is one on game day. And um, also with your uniform, you cannot wear no jewelry, no necklace, no nose rings, only your earrings. I think I told y'all that. Um, none of your big tattoos can be showing. I mean, they said that you just try, at least try to cover it up. They're not going to really trip about it. But, mm-hmm. And I feel like the do's and don'ts of being a server anyways. I'm new to this. This is my first ever serving job. So what I just learned from these past, these past two weeks of me working there is that like you want to make sure you are checking on your um whoever you're working with or like you want to first of all you want to work with the girls. Like if you see they didn't come pick up their food yet run it out stuff like that because teamwork makes the dream work. Um, you want to keep checking on your customers, making sure they have refills, making sure their food tastes good, making sure they don't want anything else, no dessert, stuff like that. You want to offer them things like, do you want to try the dessert or, you know, do you want another refill on your beer or water, lemon, stuff like that. They like when you 
baby them basically y'all i don't know how it is at other jobs but at hooters you get your tips the same day that's including credit card tips and cash tips and basically i think that's it i mean if y'all want to know anything else y'all can feel free to dm me or comment down below but i actually like it y'all and i knew i was gonna like it i like fast money and that's why i just mm, i don't know but i just feel like it's different from any other job i had only because i work in retail a lot like y'all know i worked at victoria's secret i love 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 tell this day I want to go back. I love Victoria's Secret, y'all. I love the people there and everything. But it's different from Hooters, if that makes sense. Like, I don't have I don't have to wait till my paycheck to get paid. You know what I mean? I get paid that night. I want it. It's like, but um, that's just what I've been really focusing on working school as far as right now. And believe it or not, y'all, I've been really planning out my business launching. Like, y'all, I want to show y'all so, so bad, but... It's going to be a surprise even for y'all. Y'all probably get sneak peeks when everything comes. I order my packaging. I'm just really waiting on my products to come in because I want to be really, really, really like... I want to make sure it's good. I don't want to just sell products that's not good. And that's really what I'm focusing on. Just branding it, launching it. I need to make a website. And I want two models. Like, I need two models. I just really want girls of different skin tones because I feel like I needed to show on different girls if that makes sense so that's something that I'm working on y'all and if y'all want to be a model for me just DM me I'll tell y'all all about everything I have going on and plan but that's it for this video y'all I really try my best to get y'all some content but I did talk to some girls and they're even willing to do like not interviews but like spend the days with me at Hooters they're, they're um bring the camera out they're ready to do everything contributing to my YouTube channel if that's what y'all want but I am just really I'm just really happy I really like my job y'all and I really recommend especially if you're a girly girl because a lot of girly girls work there you have to be nice like nobody wants no mean waiter and we're not really even waiters we're entertainers y'all so and everybody has to be a host like do have to be friendly nice genuine that's what i like like i like friendly nice and genuine people and i just feel like that's gonna get you far in any job you work in but especially when you're dealing with people hands on bringing them food bringing them drinks they don't want no waiting with no snobby attitude stuff like that so that's something that y'all should think about but i just want to say bye love you and don't drag me in my room because i just got out the shower like damn, she on move. Like damn, she on